Frankie. Oh my god, where is he? Frank? Frank. Oh, there you are. Hello, beautiful. What are you chewing? No. Do I get a kiss? Come here. Come here, my baby. Morning. Hello. How are you? Ooh. So good morning. I am actually in my little office again. You know, this really is kind of where I sit most of the day. So this is kind of what I see. Always have a hair bubble because my hair always really annoys me. Got my two drinks. So I've actually been using a new tea. I've been using the Twinings Glow and it's actually the nicest thing. Um, I drink it over normal tea now, and can we also appreciate my skin is breaking out, my fake tan isn't as dark. I did, um, I did do a little clip, I don't know when, this vlog is going to literally be all over the place so I do apologise, but you know, it's kind of like clung to the wrong bits, but then I didn't really exfoliate it properly, so it's my own fault. Um, but yeah, so... First of all, I want to kind of almost apologise for not uploading the last two weeks. I just, just, it was just one of those things where I needed to just kind of just take some time out and just stop, which I'm so glad that I did do because I'm so much happier now. I have completely cut down on news. I don't consume any news now, really. So if there's anything really important that I need to know about, then um, my mum or like a family member would tell me like what's been going on. But, well, I'm starting to hurt. But yeah, so I've just been getting on and doing work really. I've got a Zoom meeting in about 10 minutes, but I thought I would introduce the vlog now. But yeah, so I just wanted to say hello. How are you? Hope you're all doing well yeah let me know how you've been doing in the last couple of weeks you know how are you dealing with it all um and that kind of thing and hopefully we can have a discussion in the comments okay so i tried to find a really nice background but this is all i've got so i finally got my glossy box for this month i'm also really out of breath so please ignore that so i heard such good things about it so i thought i would treat myself so this is actually, I think it's, they've done like a mystery box for this month because th this month's box had like sold out. But I just love, I just love how they wrap stuff. So this is what you got in the box altogether. I absolutely love this. I love the packaging. I love rose gold. And also the eyelash curlers as well. I'm so excited to try out, but yeah, I'm so glad I decided to treat myself with a little glossy box. And I love how everything in the contents adds up to 50 pounds. So, and I mean, I'm trying to think how much I paid for it. I paid like a yearly subscription, but I know loads of influencers have got discount codes and things like that. So you can get a little bit of money off, but yeah, I'm so excited and so happy i'm really excited to try the hair mask i think i'm going to try that tonight actually because i need to fake tan so i might wash my hair use the hair mask and then do my fake tan which i'm really excited about as well because i'm using a different fake tan but you'll see in the next bit so as you can probably see i have just done my second day of my little workout i am going to be doing more of a like month review for this workout that i'm doing but i just wanted to quickly say i'm now about to jump in the shower and wash my hair and i'm going to use the hair mask that came with this month's glossy box i thought i'd give this a go i really want to get into hair care and i'm so glad that this came in the glossy box you can hear the showers are on so i need to jump in the shower 
Okay, so I actually just wanted to film my first reaction. Ignore the wet hair. I've had hair mask in. But I'm trying a new fake tan today. Frank has just left the building. So, yeah, I'm trying a new fake tan today. This is... Uh, oh, God, what's it called? Mine tan. Now, the reason why I decided to get this one... Because I wanted to mix up my tans. I wanted to try something a little different. Um... I always use the Bondo Sands one. I did use the Utan one. I think the last time I done a video, I used the Utan one, but I didn't end up rebuying it just because it didn't fade nicely. The colour was amazing. I like literally cannot fault the colour. But I thought I'd try something different, and this one is a violet-based fake tan. Now, so the reason why I changed over to a violet one is the fact that with the bondo sands i feel like it's so green based so it kind of it's meant to give like that olive skin look but it just ends up like going green so i did a little bit of research and found that violet based fake tans are more suitable to my skin tone so i think where did, where did i buy this i think i bought it on look fantastic or yeah I feel like it was look fantastic it's the same price point as bondi sands i feel like it may be a little bit cheaper but i thought i would get my first impressions and just show you my arms and then i'm going to go off camera i'm going to do the rest of my body now i just want to quickly do a quick shout out to this mitt this mitt has saved my life it's transformed my fake tan routine everything so this is the sienna x fake tan mitt now it feels velvety if you use the bondi sands one it's basically the same thing but i feel like the sienna x one is cheaper i think the bondi sands is like five pounds something but this one is three pound 95 or something like that um and these can go in the washing machine as well so i've used them loads and i think i've got about four or five of these as well so this is a fresh mitt fresh out of the packet i also what i like as well it comes with like a clear bag that you can keep them in so obviously you don't obviously when you've used this and got fake tan all over it you don't get it everywhere so that is also really helpful but yeah so i thought i'd show you because i don't know what color the mousse is I presume the moose would be purple. Are you coming in? Come on. Oh, he's found his bit. Mm -hmm. As I'm upstairs, Frankie was crying because normally I'm downstairs keep, keeping him company. So I thought I'd treat him to come upstairs and one of his old beds, because we've got him a new bed for Christmas. Um, his old bed is in my bedroom and he was just sitting on it. But yeah, anyway, so okay so that's what the moose looks like i can't tell if it looks purple or not i mean It's not as dark. It smells quite nice actually. Where's it from? Oh, it's an Australian brand as well. Fast drying, no orange tones, no fake tan smell. Well, you've got the no fake tan smell, correct. But on the bottle, it's, it shows you. Don't focus on my spotty face. Ah. Anyway, you can see like here. It basically just says like to leave it on for as long as possible which is what I'm going to do because I'm going to sleep in it. But, yeah, I mean, the colour's nice. I'll, I will um, I will say that. The colour is very nice. But I just hope it gets a bit darker because that's not very dark. But then I'm used to Bondo Sands and Bondo Sands is really dark. So... Who knows? Mum might actually like this colour. <laughs> weird but this is the comparison of both my arms you can't really see so this one hasn't been fake tanned and this one has so you can't really see a difference so far but it looks natural like it doesn't look like it looks like i've been sat out in the sun so so far i'm impressed so things are a little different now I think this is the first time I've actually worn makeup in one of my vlogs. Love it. 
I used the new Mumu uh, Mitchell palette and I'm really enjoying it. I'm also, excuse the horrendous mess, but I'm also watching Lizzie McGuire because, I don't know, I'm just one of those people. I just cannot do makeup to music. I always have to do it to a series or something, but yeah. Just thought I'd show you my makeup and that should show you that I do do makeup. <laughs> Hello, so it is actually the next day and this is what the fake tan looks like. Now, I'm not gonna lie, I'm not mad about it. I'm gonna be honest. It looks so natural. It doesn't look like green and just like i don't know i mean i'm not gonna lie it's not as dark as i normally have it but i do find the more kind of like natural you want your tan to look it's not going to be like that horrible like dark dark green kind of color so um yeah i really recommend this i i mean it says it's an express tan yeah, so for like an, you can use it as like an hour express tan, which to be fair would be really nice as like a top up. If I wanted it to be darker, um, I'd probably have to put like more colours on it. But as you can see, kind of like on the packaging. Yeah, so as you can see, the mousse itself is quite, it's got like a purple tone to it. I expected the mousse to be like violet, like bright violet, but it wasn't. But it's okay. But. I used a filter. Let me show you. So I did a makeup look yesterday and I used this filter and it's made me really want to have freckles. So with that being said, I'm gonna make some make some of my own with fake tan. Please ignore how spotty I am. I really do wonder why my skincare isn't working when i'm not using it and this happens now i'm not gonna lie i haven't done this before so i am just gonna quickly google how to do it i mean it's quite uh face hand freckles i mean it's pretty self-explanatory um but i want to get it right <laughs> so i don't look ridiculous I know obviously you put it on with an angle brush. I've just got this little one here. And um, I just don't know how to take it off. Oh, this girl's using a sponge. Oh, I don't have that. I'm scared this isn't gonna go very well. Oh, it looks nice on that girl. You know what, fuck it. It's for the vlog. Let's just give it a go. Right, so, oh, <laughs> this is not going well. Right, so, from the TikToks I have seen, I need to get a mirror. Who's sick of this jumper yet? I am, but don't worry, I'm gonna be doing a shop soon. Okay, so I've got my mirror set up there, and then I'm just gonna get my fake tan mitt, and then, also, another thing about this fake tan, it's very liquidy, it's not um like as moussey as the other ones but oh well right so i'm literally just gonna like dip the corner in oh, it's not working i don't want it to oh okay oh it is a little bit the question is am i gonna look like charlie d'amelio after this i bloody hope so I'm, I'm not mad about it, you know, I'm actually... I look ridiculous. This looks fucking ridiculous. <laughs> what have I done? <laughs> like, when I say this is a bad idea, this is a bad idea, I think, um, I don't know, look. I've done it. 
will i like it probably not don't like it now so i'm probably not gonna like it in about an hour's time um just is what it is <laughs> Hi guys, welcome to the vlog! Hey guys, welcome to my channel, my name's LK. <laughs> um, I'm really, really good at makeup. I I'm hate this one. She's a fool. Well, look, you can all see yourself in the viewfinder. Woo! Oh my god, oh, I'm going to be famous, mum. <laughs> I hate oh, them all. Fuck. Okay, so I actually forgot to do an outro, as per usual. <laughs> this happens every single week. But yeah, I first of all just want to say, I hope you enjoyed watching this little vlog. I wanted to include as many different kind of things that I've done like throughout the week to make it as interesting as possible. I hope I have made you laugh at my attempt at faux freckles, which as you can see, did not last. I literally did a full face of makeup after and took it straight off. So love that for me. But I do just want to quickly show you, this is what Tom has done for me. I mean, isn't he such a little artiste? He's so cute, and then he done the back as well. But yeah, so it's been a, it's been a good and positive week this week. As you can see, I'm changing my bed sheets. I hope you enjoyed watching this week's vlog. Um, I'm gonna try and make them as interesting as possible. But I want to do a makeup tutorial soon. So, with that being said, keep an eye out for next week's video, and I'll see you in my next one. Like, comment, and subscribe, please.